seen it all. This place could stand to have... Step right up, my friend. I've got a special opportunity for you approved by management themselves. <laughs> How would you like to go on a little vacation? We're talking about the greatest city on the East Coast. We are offering free travel to America's playground. Atlantic City, New Jersey. A haven of wonder, excitement, and opportunity. Fully governed and, I assure you, safe from the dangers of the outside world. In exchange for your all expenses paid for the red flight, all we ask is a little assistance paid back to the locals. Sounds like a deal, right? It varies from person to person, how to have all the details. But I know the Lombardi family is looking for assistance with some business matters. If game shows are more your style, the showmen are always looking for fresh faces to star in their entertainment. I'm sure a bright person like you will find just the opportunity you're looking for. That I'm not good enough. I just try to remember that I managed that's to get right. in the first place. That's right. As long there as the city I leadership hears your helping out, you. that's all they ask of you. They were mighty jazzed to hear word of an organization from abroad that's all about helping people. You can always use fresh faces in AC, and especially ones with initiative. That's what keeps our city alive. Now that's what I'm talking about. A little land I know you've agreed to help out, and I'm sure they get word back to the city leaders. I can't and, uh, wait until dinner. Come right back and talk to me if you have any questions, all right? I'm your one-stop guide to the city. I spend all day outside trying not to get shot at. Sometimes I miss how simple life was on the farm. I'd love to be a senior scribe someday. I can't think of a higher honor. This place is a little too cushy. I heard about what happened in Morgantown. I know it was way back. I'm glad they chose to send me somewhere safe. Not somewhere... I was out scavenging for food earlier. I only got attacked by Scorched once. Now isn't this a nice vacation, Jeremiah? The work I do is extremely rewarding, but boy is it tiring. That settled. Did Miss Rucker have any other requests I could help with? Well, not specifically asked, but. Oh, go on, dear. You know I'm thrilled to help if I can. Well, she did mention needing some help with something for the clinic. Ah, oh, I see. Certainly. And Sophie's starting her donation drive today. The lovely Miss Wagner's charitable efforts, yes. I hadn't forgotten. Oh, and Esme's got something going on in the kitchen she could use a hand with. Well, I shall certainly see what I can do about that. I'm sure I can arrange some assistance in these matters. 
If you ever find yourself in a bind, you can always call on us. Well, hello, darling. A pleasure to meet another guest of our fine establishment. I am Orlando, your host and management liaison. If you'll pardon me for just one moment, that will be all. Please give my regards to Ms. Rucker. If you are here for leisure, I regret to inform you that our regular resort activities are temporarily unavailable. However, if you are here for the refuge and the fine work of the lovely responders, I am delighted to welcome you on their behalf. Nothing else. Oh, if only he would dust those shells. Are you really, dear? How marvelous! In that case, I'm sure you can't wait to get involved here. Ah, perhaps you have not heard. The White Spring is now home to the Refuge, a place of safety and care for all in need. The Refuge is being run by the Responders, individuals committed to the well-being of their fellows. They founded the Refuge in response to new waves of refugees coming to Appalachia, people in great need of help. Food, medical care, clothing, a place to sleep. All of these are available for those who need them. What do you call a rag? What a wonderful face? thing for you to ask, darling. I knew there was something special about you from the moment I saw you. As it happens, the responders are looking for volunteers to assist them in a particular outreach effort. Those industrious wonders have repaired a vertebrate to full working order and are using it to make contact with more distant settlements. They've made allies with people in Pittsburgh, the locals call it the pit now, who seem to be in dire need of outside assistance. If you don't mind me saying so, you look like you can handle yourself. You might be just who they're looking for. Well, they'll be better able to explain the details, but I believe they're looking for fighters, actually. Their contacts in the pit are in something of a desperate situation, it seems, against a dangerous enemy. I hate the thought of you putting yourself in such danger, but it does appear to be for a good cause. They call themselves the Union. Something of a resistance movement, I understand, against more aggressive forces. One of their representatives is currently staying with us, a Mr. Skippy Rorich. Delightful is this man. A refuge or a palace? I got a veiled threat from Orlando the other day telling me they'd reprogram me if I'm not more positive. Water here's a little bland. Not enough rags to give it flavor. Oh, you're terribly brave, aren't you, dear? Imagine if we all had such courage. Now, darling, before anybody bundles you off, the first thing you should do is introduce yourself to some of the responders. I just so happen to know a few in need of more local assistance, and helping them will earn you the other thing you'll need. That other thing being, of course, their trust. The vertebrate does belong to them, after all. Our lovely Ms. Rucker is the closest thing to a leader the refuge has, though I believe she's less than comfortable with the title. You can find her in their headquarters, beyond the dining area. The darling chef, Miss Rousseau, needs some assistance in the kitchen, I hear. And Miss Wagner, over in the common area, is looking for donations. I'm sure things. your generosity will be well there rewarded. More important things to worry about? Oh, how are we going to accommodate so many guests? They aren't even paying. Wonderful, my dear. I'm certain you will be a tremendous help to them and the refuge. When you are finished with each of them, 
I recommend you speak with Mr. Skippy Rorich, the pit union representative. I imagine he'll want to discuss the situation in the pit with you before you embark. Do feel free to visit me at your leisure if you wish to chat. I have an office in the management wing. You can't miss it. Wow, they really got me set up here. Hungry? Esme's always cooking something good up in the kitchen. There's a lot of supplies here that look ripe for the picking. The potatoes here taste amazing. So fresh. Well, hello there, stranger. Pleased to meet you. I'm Sophie, Sophie Wagner. Look around. The refuge. Quite a place, isn't it? I mean, it's sure, fancy me pants, week. golf club, resort, that's it. nice, but I'm talking about the refuge. A haven for the lost, the dispossessed, the hungry, and unfortunate. A monument to our ability to have compassion for each other. Isn't it grand? Isn't it worth preserving, building, growing? Sort of. Well, I haven't seen you around before, so, uh, Damn, glad to have you. But I wasn't trying to recruit you anyway. Like I'm actually more in the material support end of things. Scouting for volunteers isn't really my department. Now that's what I'm talking about. People supporting each other. You got the right spirit. I Rucker's know. put me in charge of running a bit of a donation drive. A Have you met Rucker? She's amazing. You should. Anyway, it might surprise you to know an operation like this is always churning through supplies. We work hard to keep things in stock, and that funny Orlando character does their best to help Can't out as well, but yeah, we still have shortfalls. So here I am, asking generous folks such as yourself to help us fill in those gaps and keep the refuge running. Let me check my notes. We always need molded plastic. You can never have too much of it, and I gotta be honest, we don't have enough. I'd love it if you could help us with, oh, 50 pieces? We could do a surprising amount of good for a surprising amount of people. A lot of toys for plastic. They're always good. Some containers, like for cleaning supplies. Old food trays were often made from it too, if you find any. Uh, yeah. The warm glow of providing aid to your fellow person. The joy of supporting a noble and worthwhile cause. Isn't that great? Hmm, Yourself. okay. If that's not enough for you, Rucker's given the okay to dole out a little of some supplies we've got plenty of. I got a feeling you might be helping out there. So I bet you'll find a use for these. That's okay. Who just carries that around in their pockets or whatever, right? I'll be here all day, though. If you want to come back, bring it by later. If you can, of course, you know where to find me. It'd really make my day if you did. Glad to see you've returned. Are you ready to donate? You do? Amazing. Thank you so much. This is going to be a big help. It just so happens I got a little something for you as a reward for your generosity. We might need a lot of things, but you know how it is. Poor in one way, rich in another. I'll put together some of what we can spare for you. And I've got a feeling you're gonna need them. See? Mutual aid. Everybody wins. Thanks so much for the help. Drop by again. If I know Rucker, I'll be looking for something new every day. Take care of yourself. These respondents must really have a game plan. <laughs> the way they're always I about. heard there's a chess set around here, Something's if mine. you ever want to play. Helping people is our chief mission. The cool uniforms are... Just a nice bonus. Have any chems laying around here.
Always a pleasure to see a guest. Check in with the medics if you're feeling under the weather. Good morning. The dining room is open Bonjour. for breakfast. My name is Esme Rousseau. But Please most people around okay. here know me as Chef Esme. Your We've had some representatives from Foundation and Crater come here seeking assistance with the recent influx of refugees. I thought that we could help them out by providing some food for their people. I've started a pot of venison and tato stew, one of my newest creations. Would you be able to help me finish it? How wonderful! I can't wait to whip up something delicious for everyone! The stew requires tatoes, venison, salt, black pepper, and carrots. The ingredients can be found in our storage area. Your job is to grab the ingredients and put them in before the stew burns. Super! Let's have you start by stirring the stew, which will help keep it from burning. Remember to continuously stir the during the cooking process. Extremely rewarding. But boy, is it tiring. Fantastic! Let's get the first of the ingredients and prepare them. You're looking for There's no problem carrots, too big to solve. potatoes, and the pièce de résistance, the venison. Folks don't join the responders for caps. They join to make a difference. Please seat yourself. A waiter will be with you shortly. I think I heard a Protectron bark the other day. Am I going crazy? My friends didn't want to join up with me. Said the responders sounded like too much work. Wonder what they're doing now. I heard a bunch of nerds arguing over comic book heroes yesterday. Aren't there more important things to worry about? A dash of this. A sprinkle of that. Perfection. Smelling delicious. Let's add more flavor with some salt and pepper. No now. reservations required. Help yourself to any table. I can't wait until dinner. Mm. Mm. This blood leaf aioli really elevates the Mirelurk meat. Great work! A safe now that your stew is done, it is time others. to add your own special like touch. To or help if you look out the window. A restorative element? How inspired! Delicious and useful! I am sure whoever you choose to give it to will be very appreciative. Here is your finished stew. Now, it is time to feed some of the hungry. I believe you can find the raider and settler representatives in the bar area. You must make a choice, since there is not enough to feed everyone, I'm afraid. 
I'll do my best to gather more ingredients so that we can cook again another time. Good morning. The dining room is open for breakfast. Robot butlers? Is Please this a refuge or a palace? Why even bother helping people that can't help themselves? I suppose a nice refuge like this is worth more hungry mouths. Are you at the refuge? We've got people going hungry, and too many mouths to feed at Foundation. This stew makes me feel so restored. I haven't felt this good in a long time. Extremely lucky in here. Never felt safer. Clean here. Time to dirty it up a little. Work into the refuge as he does into the Brotherhood. We'd have utterly destroyed the fanatics by now. These refugees wouldn't last one day in Crater. There's a lot of supplies here that look ripe for the picking. they have any chems laying around here. Why even bother helping people that can't help themselves? All these supplies we could really do some good trading with the white spring i was out scavenging for food earlier only got attacked by scorch once i was out scavenging for food earlier only got attacked by scorch once this wanton robot tried to give me a haircut before running off it's a shame i can't get it the back this by wanton myself. robot tried to give me a haircut before running off it's a shame. I may have come I can't in get more. it back by myself. Hope it's on. Well, seems like timing is one of your strong suits. Look, I can stitch up a gash with the best of them. But Appalachia, well, she can do a lot worse than cut us open. Got a lot of folks here with sickness we don't understand. And injuries we don't know how to treat. What we need more than anything is know-how. So I propose we trade. What I got that I don't need, for what you need that you don't got. I've heard you're looking ahead into the pit. And the only safe way out of Appalachia is that metal bird Lennox has perched up on the roof. She don't fly without my approval, and right now, you ain't got it. So, that's the deal. You bring back medical information that'll help me figure out how to help these folks. And I'll okay your little expedition. Today you'll be going to school. What's left of it anyway. 
So talk to me. You in? Before the war, they would teach high school students about anatomy and physiology. <laughs> Isn't that wild? I don't know how helpful it was to those kids. But if there's any textbooks on the subject still intact at Morgantown High, I can damn well tell you how helpful it would be to the responders. So, what do you say? Want to help the responders make a difference? Nice. Well, let's get to it then. Anything you're able to find, go ahead and bring it back to our lead medic. I'll let her know to look for you. Good luck out there. Stopping in the chat? I'm not complaining. Can't believe we've got a bird a bird. That's a step up in the world if I've ever seen one. Been a long time coming, but the responders are back. For good this time. I think I heard a Protectron bark the other day. Am I going I crazy? heard a bunch of nerds arguing over comic book heroes yesterday. Aren't there more important things to worry about? No reservations required. Help yourself to any cable. Hey, what's up? Name's Lennox.
Rounds are looking splendid this year. Unexpected assault. Defending. <laughs> Hey, world's tough out there. Don't make it tough inside yourself, too. Looks like it might rain later.
intruder. Area secure. Approach and identify. 